Hey guys, it's Matt. Welcome to Speed Tutor, and you know I leave no stone unturned when it comes to deals and savings for all of you. And I've got 14 assets in this new Humble Bundle, which is across Massive Music Pack's entire environmental creations, UI systems, controllers, and so much more. And it's a bunch of toolkits worth well over $500, and you can get this for around £14 or $18 for all 14 and I'll go through every single asset, how to redeem it, and how to get it on your Unity account too. So the first one in this package is Nature Renderer 2022, and Nature Renderer lets you render high amounts of vegetation far faster than Unity's default terrain system can do. And as it replaces Unity's older system, it runs everything on the GPU without being CPU bound, and you can leave that to any other things that are intensively acquire the CPU, and it includes custom features that you can find in other assets. Next one, we've got the Pure Nature 2 Meadows, and this is the same developer who created the Mountains package, which I showed in a video recently with the top best new assets on the Unity Asset Store, which you could check out too for massive savings there. But this one is suitable for the built-in new RP, and it has hundreds of beautifully stylized assets across rocks, props, terrains, vegetation, and it comes with beautiful demo scenes too. Then we've got the Forest Enemy Pack, which is 14 different enemies with pre-made animations, which include fighters, warriors, flying enemies, mages, and other small enemies too. And while you're making massive savings, be sure to check out my Patreon too to support the channel and get access to over 225 different scripts, assets, and projects you cannot find anywhere else. Then we've got the Low Poly Nature Lush and Diverse Environments, which is over 800 low poly 3D models inspired by real world plants and with a diverse range of materials across all pipelines. So you can create lush, vivid environments, whether that's across trees, props, shrubs and bushes, and everything that you need for your terrain too. The next one is the Giant Golem anime set, and it's 32 different animations with 12 attacks, one idle, three defense, two dying, one dropping down, six hit, one rise, and lots of other ones in between. And then we have the Medieval Church and Monastery Kit, which is a modular kit suitable for creating this style, and all have a modular approach to building with 300 meshes, PBR textures, across roofs, interiors, props, and more. Then we have Control Freak 2, and this is a really popular asset that's been around for a long time, which is all for touch input. So it's a multi-platform input system, which supports multi-touch, accelerometers, keyboards, mouse, and game controllers. So you can use this out the box for buttons, joysticks, steering wheels, trackpads, and especially for mobile devices. Next one is the ultimate seating controller. This is to extend the ultimate character controller packages, which allows you to ride and shoot in vehicles and does require another asset to be installed. It includes a parachute ability, things like when you're in a gunship looking down on the battlefield and lots of other modulars and examples, including full UI, weapon systems, vehicles, and more. We've got the big fantasy RPG music bundle, which is 443 professionally composed pieces of music made up from 45 different tracks. You've got various themes for battles, dungeons, towns and castles, and other specific landscapes. We've got the ranking and leaderboards, which is a foundation for easily creating your own leaderboards, including things like sorting, highlighting, and user end feedback. As a full demo with leaderboards with JSON data, next one is the Gothic UI. And all elements are perfect for a dark style gothic game, whether it's an action RPG, a mobile game, anything like that. And it includes things like menus, HP bars, energy bars, inventories, buttons. Next one we have is the Zombie Voices Audio Pack, which is over 600 high quality sound effects for attacking, biting, breathing, choking, damages, deaths, grunts, laughs, pain, anything you want in a zombie themed style. Is this semantic colour palette? It's an easy way to have colour management in Unity. You can organise the colours into meaningful palettes and assign them to colourable components like buttons or UIs and things like that. We've got the Nav Tools bundle, which is a quick nav and scene nav, including scene mark, which allows you to easily navigate your scene and the hierarchy via history and favourites list, which is a good practical set of tools for really extending your Unity experience. And remember, if you're from the UK or other places, you can install UK Hot Deals on your browser and you'll get 3 or 4% back on any purchase on Humble Bundle. So it's always worth doing if you've got that. And the link is in the description for that too. So when you click to checkout and you purchase this asset, 
you can go along to your purchases and you can see I've got the Epic Game World Unity Bundle. And then on this page, you will have the $18 content. And then if you click on the button to redeem instructions, you can see that you need to be taken to the Unity Asset Store. Once you click that, you'll be taken to the Unity Asset Store itself and you just click the redeem code button and it'll directly take you to your Unity account and just put the code directly into this box, press redeem and you'll redeem all the assets on the Unity Asset Store. And if you go back to the Unity Asset Store and you want to check, you can click on my assets and then you will see them in the list on your assets. So do be sure to check out this bundle and I'll put all the links below. And also check out the video that I created on the top new assets on the Unity Asset Store because there's massive savings that I've shown there too. And also check out the top 10 Unity games that you might not have known that the best rated of all time. Big thanks to all my patrons, special thank you to Peter Steiner and everybody else who comes to watch the video. So don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Cheers.